This summer, a fascinating discovery was made, revealing a new moon falling into Earth's gravitational this pull. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. And we are getting a second moon. For 4.5 billion years, Earth got by on the one moon that we know. But from September 29th to November 25th, we're going to have a second moon. Now it's much, much smaller. If we're going to have a second moon. Now it's much, much smaller. So everybody's driving in this bus. We ended up going to a gas station and we parked and we're walking around and it was nighttime and all of a sudden I looked up um, through the trees and I saw this bright white moon. It was so big, it was a full moon and it was all white. And then I looked up a little further and boom, there's another white full moon. It was it was like a, a really clear white with a little yellow in it and it was full. It was very pretty. And so there was two of them and then after I saw that, I remember when I saw the moon, I felt this feeling of like, I've never seen anything like this before. Is anybody else seeing this? I kept saying in my dream. And um, so then I turned around, I started walking back further by the gas station, and I saw these older women sitting outside on chairs, and some other people, my dad was in the dream, and all of a sudden I saw this big um, meteor come right across the sky. It was so beautiful. So today I wanted to do a, another video um, talking about this specific dream that I had um, on May 12th, not too long ago, or this year, 2020. I had a dream that I saw a big meteor, a big moon, okay? It was big, right in my face, big moon. And in this big moon, it was a little bit hazy. Like it was hard to see the, the clarity of the moon, but then it became more clear. It was a big moon, really big. And then on the upper right side, I saw a normal sized if moon. We're going to have a second moon now. It's much, much smaller. This is at 2 a.m. in the morning. Um, I, for whatever reason, I got out of the bed to look at the moon. This is in my dream. And the moon was full and bigger than normal. And I noticed next to it was like an outline of an eclipse happening. Like it was darker on the edge with the dotted line. With, I'm sorry, with a dotted outline that began to form. Then I got back into the bed and thought this eclipse was very unexpe unexpected and no one even mentioned it happening. So then I went downstairs to wash some clothes. And while in the basement, I thought to look outside again and the outline of the eclipse got even bigger. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. So I had this dream May 22nd, 2021. Um, and in the dream, I am sitting in a house that is not my own. Um, I don't know whose house it was, but at the time, like we we're sitting in this home and um, I was with a group of people and we were discussing um, like moving. And um, like, I had a feeling like it was realtors and we were discussing like house things. So um, in this room that I'm sitting in, it's like a dining room. I could see there's like big open windows and I can see outside my son is playing in the backyard. Well, it suddenly falls tonight and I'm, I go outside and to this backyard 
to tell my son to come inside from playing because it's, it's getting dark now. And when I go outside, I see huge in my face, a huge low and close to the earth blood moon. A red, orange, very detailed, crisp moon, full and, and vivid and bright. And it was like, just jaw dropping. Like, what is this moon doing so close to earth? Uh, almost concerning, but there was no fear. And behind this huge blood moon was like a crescent moon, like just slightly behind it, but farther away and smaller was like a regular size, just normal crescent moon. We're going to have a second moon now. It's much, much smaller. I was hearing or seeing something happening going on outside. So I walk outside and I'm looking at the sky uh, and the horizon. And in the horizon, I see one huge moon to my right. And I can see, uh, but there's darkness starting to come and it's starting to come closer. It's like a cloud of darkness. And over to my left is a smaller uh, full moon um, as well. So both moons are full, one's slightly bigger than the other. This summer, a fascinating discovery was made, revealing a new moon falling into Earth's gravitational pull. And we are getting pull. a second moon. For 4.5 billion years, Earth got by on the one moon that we know. But from September 29th to November 25th, we're going to have a second moon now. It's much, much smaller. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. Peter preaching to the crowd. And, it, and he says, this is what the Bible prophesied about. He says, and it shall come to pass in the last days, saith God, I will pour out of my spirit upon all flesh. And your sons and your daughters shall prophesy and your young men shall see visions and your old men shall dream dreams. And on my servants and on my handmaids, I will pour out in those days of my spirit, and they shall prophesy. And I will show wonders in heaven above and signs in the earth beneath, blood and fire and vapor of smoke. The sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood before the great and notable day of the Lord come. And it shall come to pass that whoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. So I find that very interesting. Um, first of all, yes, the Bible says that the moon can be used for a sign. Um, Peter quotes Joel chapter two and says, we are living in these days when God will pour out his spirit on all flesh and people will have dreams and visions. And the moon, being turned into blood is even listed in that same passage. So, yes, I believe we do have scriptural precedent to consider um, what all these believers are dreaming about. Let's take it to the Word of God, let's take it to the Lord and pray on it. But very clearly, there's, I'm telling you, going back like 11 years or so, there's a lot of people who claim to be Christians at least who are having these dreams about uh, two moons or two planets or something like that. I was totally not aware of it at all until my wife had this dream in January of 2021. And then I started to look into it a little bit and realize, whoa, and I told her, I was like, babe, a lot of people have had these two moon rapture dreams. And she was totally shocked because she had never heard of it before. Okay. Let me share with you her dream. So this was uh, like a, in January of 2021 and she had this dream. She was, it's her dream started. She was in like an apartment room with her friend and her, it was an old friend from her past that she doesn't really know now. Um, and this friend, as far as she knows, and as far as she um, remembers, doesn't really have a strong relationship with the Lord and may not even be a Christian at all. Okay, so she's with this friend in the apartment and she she looks out the window and all of a sudden she sees this absolutely massive 
moon. She said it was, she just thought this can't be real. It was way, way, way too big. Like it was, you know, almost filling a portion of the entire sky. And she instantly, she, she told me she had this very strong feeling that it was false or it was, it was fake or something like that. And that the real moon was somewhere out of her sight, but it was, it was there. So the real moon was, was somewhere, the regular moon was somewhere else, but this massive fake or false moon was, was just absolutely captivating. And she said the moment she saw it, she started saying, this is it. This is it. The rapture's happening. This is it. The, the rapture's happening now. And she was looking at her friend and she was saying, this is it. The rapture's this happening. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. Just remember laying on the ground in my dream and looking up and there were two moons and um, it was like the identical scene but two of them, two moons with stars around it. And I remember hearing other people's stories about two moons um, on YouTube so I kind of knew what it meant in the dream and I was like, ooh, it means it's time for the rapture or whatever. Well, hello, YouTube. This is my first time doing a video, and uh, just wanted to share a dream I've had. Uh, in the past, a lot of people are sharing dreams online uh, that they've had that sort of point to the end times um, events and, I guess, rapture events. Um, this wasn't exactly what I would call a rapture, but it lines up with a lot of the other videos I've been seeing that involve moons. So um, I actually wrote down the dream. So I'll read what I wrote and then kind of elaborate on it. Uh, this was in August of 2022 and I had a dream of two full moons. One was huge and uh, the other one was smaller and I remember looking at the huge moon and actually tr looking down or kind of looking to the side of that and I go, oh wow, there's another moon. We're going to have a second moon. It's much, much smaller. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. I dreamt that I was in my apartment and I was looking outside my window and what I saw was this big uh, moon and it almost looked like a super moon or something. It was so big and very low in the sky and it was very detailed. It was almost like I could see every, every detail of the moon. Um, and this big circle of light came around it um, and in the corner of this um, circle was this beam of rainbow light that almost looked like a crown and I was just watching this moon and, and then this smaller moon that was much brighter than, than this moon came in the scenery and it was somewhere around here and it just went in this motion in front of the moon and just out of the scenery just this much smaller moon and brighter uh, what was below the moon was just simply um, uh, mountains and I, I you know my my eyes weren't focused on it my eyes were only focused on this moon and oh sorry and when I saw this moon, I was, I knew that, that the rapture will be taking place the same night. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production.
This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. Beautiful brothers and sisters in Christ, I hope that you're all doing well, that you're having a wonderful and a blessed day in the Lord. I want to share with you a dream that I had two nights ago from the Lord. He has been confirming this dream to me a lot and wanting me to share this with you. And he led me to paint the scenery for you also so that you could understand better what I saw exactly in the dream. Um, and I hope you enjoy. Lord, I pray that you will be here with me and you will speak through me and that you will minister to your people. Let your will be done. I plead the blood of Jesus over this video and over the listener. I pray that you will help me to remember this dream correctly and that this dream will encourage your people and lift them up and that you will use it for your glory and your purpose and you will co convict the listener to turn away from this world and from sin and to turn to you instead and I pray that everyone listening will be encouraged to get their oils filled and that I pray that they will all be accounted worthy to escape the things that are about to come 